Hello and welcome. In this problem, we are simplifying the product of the expression below. So, I would pause the video, try it on your own, see what you can do. All right, so product, of course, uh, what does that refer to, right? Product refers to multiplication. And the expression we have right here consists of two binomials, 3x plus 2, two terms, it's a binomial. 4x squared minus 3, there's another one. So if we set up the multiplication of this and we keep track of it in an area model, this is one way to do it, right? We basically, we have 3x plus 2, that's one of our binomials, and so I'm saying that on this side of our area model we have 3x and then 2. And over here we have 4x squared, and even though it's negative, we're just using a model, we have minus 3 here. Now I'm going to define the corresponding products. So there are four products to look at, represented by the four areas of this model. So we have 3x times negative 3, it's negative 9x. We have 3x times 4x squared, what's that? Well, 4 times 3 is 12 x squared times another x, that's x to the third. Over in the bottom left, we have two groups of 4x squared, that's 8x squared, right? And then we have two groups of negative 3, that's negative 6. So now if we add all these pieces together, we have 12x to the third, all by itself. Then we have um, 8x squared and minus 9x, right? These two terms next, they can't be added, they're, they're not like terms. Right, minus 9x, and then finally, finally over here, minus 6. So that would be our answer. And I see that the closest thing we have uh, is choice C. Notice that the order is slightly different. They wrote 12x to the third, minus 9x, and then plus 8x squared, minus 6x. And this is minus 6, excuse me. This is the same thing. Uh, if you're not sure, we write everything in terms of addition, right? And you'll see what's happening. So minus 9x is the same thing as adding a negative. And because you're adding these two terms, you can change the order. So that means you can move this term here and reverse it, put 8x squared over here. And then we have plus negative 9x plus 8x squared. It's still the same thing. So if you think of it in terms of addition of negatives, you can see how to move the terms around. And then you just rewrite it back. Instead of adding a negative 9x, you can just say minus 9x. That's equivalent. And then plus 8x squared minus 6. So that's our answer. Hope this helps.